all you most amazing artists, Mrs. Fowler here in my home studio, and we are ready for our very first virtual lesson. Now today I want to start with something that is positive to spread a little cheer during this tricky time. It's also something we can all do. This piece of art is going to be something that you can share with all the people around you. We're going to be creating something called a positivity poster. And with this project, you can really make it however you want. You can use whatever message you would like. It could be as simple as I love you and stay safe, or you can turn it into a positive quote if you're a bigger kid. This project can be done with something as simple as just a pencil or even a pen. And if you have colors, you can add a little flair that way. Now, most of us might not have big fancy construction paper at home. So you might have to use something like copy paper, lined notebook paper. You could even cut up an old cereal box and use that cardboard. You could even use newspaper or magazine. Now with this project, your message will inspire people no matter what you use. So get creative. I want you to have fun. I want you to share your creativity with everyone around us. And I want you just to create. You're so amazing at that, and that is something that I sure miss. Now, boys and girls, I'm gonna switch over to that kind of top-down view where I use that gooseneck holder so it looks like our document camera at school. With that view, I'm gonna show you how I created one of my posters, but more importantly, after that, I cannot wait to see what you come up with. You are amazing artists and never forget that. All right, let's have some fun and create some art. So guys, to start, I'm gonna sketch out my message with a pencil. This is going to be those positive words like stay safe, I love you, be positive, let's all be well, breathe, or we can do this. Something to make people feel good. You might wanna make it big so others can see it, I'm hoping that you guys can hang this in your windows or on your front door to share your message with everyone. Now, when I'm feeling worried or anxious, I like to hear, it will be okay. So that's what I'm going to write as my message this time. Next, I'll make the letters nice and dark by tracing it with Sharpie. My hands started getting tired, so I had to get a big black marker. Now that we're done with the Sharpie, it's the fun part. I decided to add some color to mine with crayons. You can use anything you have around. Markers, crayons, colored pencils, even highlighters will work. Just make it special and your own. So guys, I decided to take a quick break from coloring before I finished it up. And I came out here to spread my message, even on my sidewalks. Found some chalk in my garage, and let's take a look. All right, owls, here's my finished poster. It's a great reminder for me to take a minute and remember to slow down, take a breath, and remind myself that it's all going to be okay. My plan is to hang it on my front window so that others can enjoy it too. I was having so much fun that I made a second one. Now, boys and girls, I hope you have fun creating your own positivity poster. And remember that the magic of art is creating something special for you. I can't wait to see what you come up with. I just know I'll love it. See you next time, my most amazing artists.